I want our young people to know that they matter, that they belong. So don't be afraid. You hear me, young people? Don't be afraid. Be focused. <laughs> be determined. Be hopeful. Be empowered. Empower yourselves with a good education. Then get out there and use that education to build a country worthy of your boundless promise. Lead by example with hope, never fear. You should never view your challenges as a disadvantage. Instead, it's important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is actually one of your biggest advantages. Life will put many obstacles in your path that are far worse than a bad grade. You'll, you'll have unreasonable bosses and difficult clients and patients. You'll experience illnesses and losses, crises and setbacks that will come out of nowhere and knock you off your feet. But unlike so many other young people, you have already developed the resilience and the maturity that you need to pick yourself up and dust yourself off and keep moving through the pain. Keep moving. tempted to find a community of like-minded folks and work with them on causes you care about and just tune out all of the noise. Our greatness has never ever come from sitting back and feeling and isn't about how your life looks to others. It's about how it feels to you. To succumb to feelings of despair and anger only means that in the end, we lose. Those feelings are not an excuse to just throw up our hands and give up. Not an excuse. They are not an excuse to lose hope. In the end, it's up to each of us to define ourselves. It's up to each of us to invent our own future with the choices we make and the actions we take. I want our young people to know that they matter. <laughs>